Lames. Okay. That's right. His name is Lames now. Lames. Okay. Lames. Uh, I'm going to call him Eon because I feel like Lames is kind of mean. <laughs> I mean, he's the one that made his name that. He, so he did, and he he, wants, he was very he was very um, proactive about you know it is just his name, but with an L instead of a J. I see. And I okay. said, you know, that is true. Uh, but he also said we don't mind if we call him Eon. You know what? I feel like Eon's. I like Eon because that's that's the kid that I met okay. all the all the way back in Smash Four. But here we go. AC still sticking to his tried and true his brawl his brawl veteran. Snake and of course Eon, who was a uh, for anyone new in the stream, uh, primarily a Fox player, and now he's been getting a lot of success with Joker. Mm -hmm. Already, you're seeing that. Uh, oh! Oh my God! Oh! Oh my! Well, apparently, already you're seeing the AC losing his first stock very quickly. Yeah. <laughs> what the heck? Like, I I know it was gonna be like, of course, uh, for if you're familiar with how Snake plays, it's very trap heavy. A lot of grenades, a lot of explosions, uh, and then uh, tech chases when it's that time. Um, but that was just a straight up throw off, throw snake. Oh, and a miss Ooh. input. This is not AC's game. Yep. And for, especially for this to be the game where, you know, this is the, the qualifier into top 24. Mm -hmm. But, you know, takes that up till it's going to be able to close out that stock. Still, two stocks behind, us, uh, or a full stock behind then at 0%. So it's going to be quite a bit to try and catch up to. Yeah, and normally I would say like being Snake, you you have that luxury of being super heavy, you have a lot of projectiles, you have the ability to bring out a grenade, frame one, and get a trade, which is super awesome in this game. But Ooh. when you're playing against Joker... Dang, that killed? That was yeah, quick. Uh, quick game. I'm actually surprised that the back air had enough launch for it, to, had enough power mm -hmm. to uh, actually break uh, Snake away from his... Um, his cipher. Yeah, that's that was really weird. Yeah, I, was, I wanted to compliment uh, Lanes earlier that he was, you know, grabbing the grenades before they detonated and mm. then pulled out the the down beat so that he could oh, get, yeah, that, yeah, get the, that meter going. The rebel guard. Mm -hmm. So I think it was making AC a little bit hesitant about when he's going to cook his grenades and when he's going to leave them on the ground. So you saw it a little bit less. That gave Lanes a little bit more time to just actually to play on the aggressive side where he wants to. So mm -hmm. let's see where he goes this time. This time he's just straight up tossing them, not leaving them on the ground for And, and honestly, I think that is the correct play. Mm -hmm. Because even if Eon or Lanes does, in fact, go for the Rebel Guard, guess what? You can throw another grenade, or you can even like take that time to approach and then go for either uh, a grab, or you can set up your next trap. Yeah. With, it, with your C4 or, you know, whatever other shenanigans Snake has in his arsenal. Yeah, regardless, you're going to be giving him the damage anyway, so mm. might as well try and set up to give yourself approach. Like, already Arson is available barely 30 seconds into the match. Yeah, and of course, like, whenever you have Arson, you, your, your aerials, your attacks are just that much better. You have access to, like, do new confirms, like, down air into up smash. And as you can see, AC just retreating to the air, making sure that he burns as much time on that meter as possible. Yes. All right, he's got himself in position again. This time, he's got himself a good lead. Didn't get his stock immediately depleted. And now you can see what the more Woo. traditional match is going to look like. Takes Woo. the damage, gets the C4 explosion. is going to be able to take that stock. Yeah, of course, that C4 comes in handy as, as a snake player. You're going to always want to be trapping your opponent. And sometimes, it's just about throwing so many so many traps, items, attacks at your opponent that they just simply forget the awareness of where that C4 is placed. And the moment they forget about it, that's usually when you're going to detonate it. All right, dash attack, he's got the position. He's going to go high. How's he going to land though? Two B reverses, very nice. Mm -hmm. Getting that mix up on his landing, making it very difficult for for Eon to uh, maybe even try and challenge it with an up air. <laughs> going to get that throw, Nikita comes out. Ooh, okay, Rebels guards it. He's going to have to find himself back on the ledge though. The Tetra card comes out, but the timing oh. is off, but he's able to bring it back around. Tr yeah. Stock trade for both of them. Honestly, I feel like the, the Tetra card actually did uh, a Eon in a little bit because it did activate. He did reflect the projectile, but he was stuck in that animation, which is what gave AC the opportunity to take the second stock. Okay, just again, burning the meter on this, uh, on Arsene and retreating to the sky. Whenever you're at the ceiling, like, uh, and you're in control, you'll kind of just kind of ride along the top. And that's just going to even burn more time on Arsene. 
Yeah, let's see. He's got a whole stock ahead. I, pretty, I mean, of course, Joker is a really great comeback character. He's got Arch Sense soon. Let's see what he's going to do with it. Going to go for the mix-up. Oh, mm -hmm. almost called it out too, but a mis-execution on the roll read. Yeah, and the one thing to get to remember, like, I'm sure it's been said many times, but was that a sticky? Was it? I don't know. Oh, no, Som I sometimes it. Snake goes so fast with where he's putting everything, it's hard to keep track of where everything goes. I feel like he was up high enough so that he would have jumped over it, but maybe he was still at the start of his, like, or at the end of his jump squat, mm -hmm. so that's why he got caught. But one thing to remember is, like, a lot of these players here, just about everybody, is getting accustomed to offline again. And I was telling a lot of players, you know, there was a lot of players here who were really excited to be here, but nervous at the same time because, you know, they were players that were getting results before quarantine, and now they don't know if they can do it again. And I would just tell them all, like, look, it's the first MSN back. Everyone gets a pass. Yeah. Everyone gets a pass. I Maybe mean, not for the PR, but, yeah. you know. <laughs> but for your pride, for your confidence, you should get a pass. Yeah. I mean, the tournaments are going to be happening anyway. So you yeah. just got to take it as is. And we'll then. be back next week, yeah. I hope. Oh, oh, I hope. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> all righty. Here we go. And, of course, our new stage list. We're actually going to go to this stage instead of Kalos. Yeah, forget so. Kalos. Kalos is out. Yep. <laughs> no more of that. Thank you, Sephiroth, for bringing back this stage. Oh, yeah. Good times. And Pig. Yeah, with the, with this new uh, stage, it kind of gives you a new, a different um, layout for the stage. You know, a lot of people were kind of looking towards a small battlefield to have this similar sort of layout, mm -hmm. but instead, you know, we, we ended up choosing this stage. Mm -hmm. The platform's being a little bit more spread out. Yeah, and that's okay, I think. I mean, obviously, we're gonna have to experiment and see, but I think this is a, a good addition to the stage list as opposed to Kalos, so. Okay, very interesting from Eon. Instead of opting for the last second aerial, usually you'll see Joker players like gun down, and then right when they're in within their opponent's uh, shield radius, they'll actually throw out like a forward air or a back air. Mm -hmm. uh, this time he actually opted to land, giving him the mix up and the ability to grab AC. A okay, good chase good with tag. the Nikita. Another Nikita, but he's able to sweet spot the ledge just in time. Can't close out the stock before Arson goes away. He's gonna have to find another way, get an edge guard or something. Yeah, of course, retreating to the sky. Now, what, one thing for, for AC is that whenever he gets hit by the, the Eha, you know, that's going to be taking damage no matter where he goes. So if he retreats to the sky, guess what? That's just dot damage. That's just damage. Free damage. Mm -hmm. That was a good um, execution by AC. I think he pancaked after the Nair, and then Lane thought he could get the back air out of shield, but it wasn't quite enough, and then he saw his opportunity to take the up tilt, take the stock as well. Mm -hmm. But we got a trade here. 90% uh, on lanes, still pretty much anyone's game here. This yeah. is still best of three because it's uh, going into top 24, so. Yeah, I do believe that that is correct, right? This is, in fact, best of three? Yes. Uh, yeah, 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 so yeah. Until, until winter semis, yeah, so. Which I, I think that there's this one and then there's one more. Yeah. So, I mean. Yeah. Let's see how he goes in. Tried to get the up tilt, not quite. Dropping the grenade when he gets thrown, that's actually so lucky for AC. Okay, tech chase. Oh, he had the right read, but again, the execution. And, you know, we'll, we'll just chop it to, you know, first day back. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I'm sure we've seen. Ooh, oh my god, he chased him so high. He actually threw out the, he threw out the whip. <laughs> Got him. Yeah, he was trying to do it the first time, and I was surprised that AC decided to go high again because, you know, he had that idea, so he gave it to AC. He said, you know, if you're going to do it again, I'm going to go ahead and try and do that. And he was able to execute it properly for the stock this time. Yeah, but the last hit of Nair connecting onto Eon, and here we are, ladies and gentlemen. Game three, one stock apiece. This is to make it into top 24, which really uh, is the difference between either playing two to three games to make it into top eight, or playing five to six games into top eight. Yep, you definitely want to be in winners in this type of tournament, especially the first one back. But let's see. Got still some good execution. Yeah, percents are on Eon's side, but really what I'm looking at is that meter next to uh, next to Joker's picture. The closer we get to Arsen, that's going to be the opportune moment for Eon to try and close out this game and win the set. And being okay, here we go. Only 78% onto AC. And looking at throwing out these hitboxes, these especially the, like, these bigger hitboxes and these trades are going to work so well because every hit that you hit Joker with while Arsene's out, it's going to deplete that meter. But wow, dropping the C4 into this invisible dark.